start. Just what you do when your horse gets in the chute. First thing you do is halter him. Gotta be a lot more careful with a lot of other horses, but he's good. Get it pretty snug, not super tight or anything, but just snug. And I won't do it, but uh, you take his mane and you you tie it in a knot, and uh, it just just to prevent it from sliding over his ears. You know, sometimes that'll happen, so you just you just tie a knot around it, and then. You're good there, and then, like we said, you when you when before you put a saddle on him, you'll get a mane. They call it like a mane and an eye. Like you just you pull it, not real tight, but you bring it back, and you kind of mark right where, it's, make sure his head's straight, and you mark right where his mane ends, and then you can, like you can run it over their head, and then you bring it right to the top of their eye. And this horse, like most of them, it's the exact same spot. And a lot of, like, then you want to, you want to mark that. And a lot of guys will pull just a little chunk of mane out. I'm not going to do it, but pull just a little chunk of mane out and mark where that is so you don't lose it. Um, I used to, I used to just have a piece of shaft fringe that I kept in my rein. And I just moved it every time so I didn't have to do that. And then when you're done, you, whatever, like I'm, left-handed you know I ride left-handed so it'll be on your left side and you just make sure it's on that side and you, you take it over his neck and you bring it back through itself not tight or anything but just to kind of get it out of its way and then you're ready to saddle him and then when you like when you go to measure your rein like that you, you need somebody and you want them just to like you want their head to be kind of in a normal position and straight. And like you want to, your helper, like they'll hold them, like they don't need to grab them. They just kind of need to make sure, you know, that they keep their head straight and, and leave it about right there. So if you would do that, Madeline. <laughs> and like, and then when you pull, you, you pull it back pretty snug, not terribly, but pretty snug. And you, you take your hand here, put it against your swells. And then, and then you come up with that, and that's an average. And honestly, I wish we would have marked that other because it's probably pretty close to the exact same spot as your mane and your eye. And then from there, you can determine whatever your contractor tells you. Like we talked about, you know, at, this is average. You know, X and two would be there, three, four, double X, you know, would be back there. So whatever they say, you usually take. They, they usually, I mean, they usually tell you pretty straight forward because that's their horse is going to buck the best way with that amount you know that you're lifting on them so you take that wherever it is you usually mark it again so you like you'll know so you don't have to keep hold of it 